Sugar interview time with the one and only Nathan Gamble, everybody. Yes. You guys know him from Dolphin Tale, Dolphin Tale 2, but you have like a really long list, yeah. a really long resume from uh, The Dark Knight mm -hmm. to Babel with Hello Brad Pitt, Brad Pitt to yeah. um, also uh, television roles including NCIS Los Angeles, Private Practice, House, Ghost Whisperer, CSI, Hank, Runaway, Good Luck Charlie, and Without a Trace. That's You're a lot 16 of stuff. years old, and I feel like that you have a resume that is that you could equate to an, an adult that's been working in the industry for quite some time. I've been very blessed with a lot of wonderful projects. And wow. On behalf of all the hosts of Pop Trigger, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> continue, continue. Let some other people get some roles. Jeez. <laughs> so We're what? Up for a lot of the same stuff. <laughs> uh, what did what led you to become an actor in the first place? Uh, well, I just I loved doing impressions when I was young, like around six. I got in the business like when I was six, seven. I just I loved being other people. Like I would do an impression of like Ace Ventura, uh, Kermit the Frog. I would do uh, just Mickey Mouse. Can we I would see just... one of them? Can you just throw one of them out there it's for us? It's the Muppet Show with our very special guest, Kermit the Frog. Yay! 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 Good. Yay! Oh my gosh. Okay. And then, so did it take quite some time for you to finally book something, or was it immediate? Uh, well, actually, it was a nationwide search for uh, Babel, and I was up in Seattle, and I had this uh, agent in Bellevue, and it was my second. Audition, actually, what? which is which is really wild, and I, I got the role. And uh, uh, when we were filming in Mexico, I had a bodyguard too, which is like like a month ago I was just in my house playing yeah. with string, and now I'm, I have a bodyguard <laughs> in, in Mexico. And he's like, no string. <laughs> <laughs> and the producer, he's like, what are you doing after this? And we're like, mm, I don't know. And he introduced me to my uh, manager in LA, and then my agent, and then that was 10 years ago. Wow, that huh? is amazing. That's great. Yeah. That's, That's so great. And mm -hmm. what was it? Did you? So you obviously got to meet Brad Pitt, and you worked with him. Actually, I didn't have any scenes with him because if you see the movie Babel, it was actually nominated for Best Picture. Yes, uh, I know. Uh, there's four different storylines. Uh, I'm I'm his son, but I'm in Mexico and he's in Morocco. Okay. Uh, I did meet him at the uh, premiere. And what was that like? Uh, he's very attractive. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. yeah. I love it. Okay, so let's talk about Dolphin Tail because Dolphin Tail is a is a really struggle for me. I love it so much, but I also get really sad when I see animals struggle. Mm -hmm. But of course, we all know that your character is the one that was pivotal in saving Winter. Thank God, which is based on a true story. Yep. So so many questions here. First of all, what was it like working with dolphins? And then we'll go into Dolphin Tail. Too. Wow, it's just so different uh, because, you know, I worked on Marley and me, and when you're with dogs, they're dogs, they're, they're dumb. Yeah. You know? mm -hmm. uh, but dolphins are so intelligent. Oh. I, I considered Winter and Hope uh, just other actors wow. because they're, they're, they, you can feed off of their energy and they're just very communicative with people and it's just it's it's incredible unbelievable and you were you you were in the water with them that's yeah. un, what it, yeah. so what do they feel like are they really it's rubbery like, uh, yeah smooth uh, wet silk. And at rubbery silk, I guess, would be Did you hug way. really tight? Did you oh hug them? Gosh. I would have hugged yeah. so tight. There's this tight. thing where we do where we sink to the bottom, and I hold both their pectoral fins, and we sort of are in this hugging mm. embrace, and we spin up to the top, and it's I just it's like, oh. You know, because some people, when they go to, like, I don't know, SeaWorld or something, and they get to touch a dolphin for, like, a minute and pay, like, thousands of dollars. Yeah. Uh, but I got paid to do it for, like, three yeah. months, which is pretty cool That's to say so that. Yeah. cool. That's uh, definitely a dream come true, I, I would think, for me, and I'm sure a lot of kids out there. So Dolphin Tale 2, what can we expect of Dolphin Tale 2? Um, well, Winter's the president. Yes. Uh, Oval Office is underwater. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, That's uh, awesome. It's been done. Yeah. <laughs> no, uh, it takes place uh, four years uh, after the first one. Uh, I'm now an employee there. Oh, um, at the aquarium? Yeah, at the aquarium. Awesome. Yeah. And uh, I just am doing what I love, uh, helping animals. Uh, I'm with people who I really love and, and with my best friend. And life is pretty good for Sawyer. Wow. Yeah. And of course, we also have Ashley Judd in the movie, Harry Connick Jr. You're a big fan. Uh, Morgan Freeman. So what was it like? Mo Free. Yeah. What do you call him? Mo Free Hello. Yeah, Morgy. <laughs> We're close. What is it like that working is all with. Right. with <laughs> call me that name. <laughs> he, yeah, he narrates everything. Everything nowadays. <laughs> yep. um, what is it like working with them? All of them? Oh, well, I mean, everyone knows that they're really great actors, and for Harry, uh, great singers. And you know what's weird? Morgan Freeman sang more on set than Harry did. Really? He has what? This beautiful voice. He does? Really? Yeah. I don't it's, doubt that, but it's he still has a, a just surprise. just a beautiful voice. Uh, but, you know, everyone knows they're great actors, but they're really great people. Really Love humble, hearing that. Really fun to work with. I mean, Harry, he just. He brightens every every uh, room he's in. Really, he's just he's so much fun to work with. I want your life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we also get we also grant wishes here on this show. This Ooh. is actu actually a, a very powerful magic wand. It's, weird. Uh, it's a different brand of magic. No, it wand isn't. Every... This is the same one, same Brett. One? Don't I'm ruin sorry. the magic. Yeah, this is blue. the same. 
the same exact Sorry, one. My bad. My yeah, bad. something's wrong with you. Okay, so <laughs> we are going to grant you two wishes. One is going to be personal, one's going to be professional. And really think about it. So the first one, what do you want to happen personally? Uh, I want to be the play-by-play -play commentator of the Seattle Seahawks. Oh! Oh, mm. boop. Okay, oh, what about, that's, that's kind of professional. Uh, I guess it's, uh, that would be sort of a plan B for me if okay. the acting thing tanks. I think your um, acting thing is uh, on the, the right. up and up, so <laughs> don't yeah. you worry. Mm -hmm. And then what would be, I guess we're saying personal, personal, professional, pick, whatever, it doesn't oh, matter. boy, let's see now. Because they I blend together, I feel like, with you. Wish, I guess. Yeah, right. it can be anything. Um, more friends. Yeah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Figure that one out. <laughs> oh, your friends? Uh, no, no uh, I think just I. Uh, this is gonna sound really awful. I want just a big house with bowling alleys and ping pong tables and flat screen TVs and Xbox 360s and football fields and because why not? If you're gonna do wishes, let's go. It's gonna happen. Go yeah. Yeah. And oh, boop. boop. It's gonna happen. Yeah. Big old boop. And then also you have an upcoming appearance on CSI. Yes. When yeah. is that happening? Uh, what is your character like? October 19th. Okay. Uh, it's really cool because I sort of play this geeky nerd that uh, is doing a selfie video of, um, the first scene is me doing a selfie video of my high school, right? And it's basically me holding this guy's camera uh, for like five minutes straight and I'm walking through these this uh, the campus yeah and it was just it was so much fun I got to work with the great Ted Danson that's right yes. oh, man. and wow. and he is also very handsome yeah, yeah yes. so the model before yeah. he got the cheers roll is that true yeah also been wearing I think he looks better with his white hair I think he does I think he looks yeah. dashing yeah. yeah yeah very dashing love Ted wow. Danson wow <laughs> so this is October 19th October 19th October 19th yes. you can catch uh, and what is your character's name Boy, I forgot. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> I thought you were going to say boy. I was going to say catch boy. Boy number two. <laughs> <laughs> no, but please catch Nathan on CSI on October 19th, as well as Dolphin Tales 2. Don't forget to check it out. Big round of applause for our guest, Nathan Gamble. Yeah. We'll see you guys all next time on Pop Trigger.